Hi there, this is Luke from China's Capital. In this video, I'm going to show you how to do the Mac 3 subway setting. Now let's start the installation. Uh, when you install this software, your firewall might stop it, but you just need to allow it and it's safe. So let's get started. Yes, allow it. Then it is quite simple, just click next and then agree. Then you can choose a location for Mac 3, it's up to you. You can choose wherever you want. Then click next. Then you just leave it. You don't need to change anything here. Then just click next. Next. Then finish installation. Then you will have like four icons. Then you just choose this one, Mac 3 mil. After installation, there will be four icons in your computer. Then what you need to choose is this one, Mac 3 mil. Let's click it. There are a few steps to do the software setting. And mostly we will do it here, the config. It is for configuration. And the first step is to do the unit setting. Then select native unit. Then what we need to choose is NS. Do not choose inches. Or you know, it is not for it is not right for our machine. Then that's it for the first step. The second step is for port and pins setting and make sure here this port it is 378 and this one is 278 it's default but you just you know have a look and just in case and make sure it is, it is uh, 25,000 hertz here and then just click yeah it means confirm here it is Chinese The third step is for motor output setting. It is also in the config and the ports and pins. Motor output. Um, make sure you enable all the assets you want to use. And the basic three is XYZ. And if you want to use the fourth axis, then you just enable it. Then move on to step pin. Make it two for x axis four for y axis then six for z axis um, eight for a axis then move on to third pin make it three for x and then five for y 7 for Z, then 9 for A axis, then move on to the step low here, this one, and then you enable XYZ. Mm, if you want to use the fourth axis, you don't need to enable this one, you just leave it here, just enable the three, then you are good to go. Then move on to step port, make it 1 for y axis, no no, make it 1 for x axis, then 1 for y axis, 1 for z axis, and third port, yeah, 1 for a axis as well, and then third port, make them more 1, 1, 1, then you're good to go. Uh, make sure you do exactly as what I did here. Have a look. 
or your machine won't work correctly. So you need to make sure and have a look. Okay, then click apply, then confirm. The fourth step is for emergency stop. It is still in the config and then pins and post the same, but this time is in input signals. And you scroll down and you find a e stop here and then you enable it. Then move to port, make it one, and then pin number, make it 10. And then enable the active load. And that's it for the fourth step. Then just apply it and then save or confirm. Just leave the other figures the same as here. Don't change anything. The fifth step is for limit switches setting. It is also in the config and then ports and pins, then input signals. Then you scroll down, or you don't need to scroll down. Then you can see X plus plus, X minus minus. It is for X axis limit switches. And Y plus plus, Y minus minus, then Z plus plus, Z minus minus. And uh, please note that there's no need to do the limit switch setting for A axis because the fourth axis doesn't have limit switches. So you don't need to do the three axis X, Y, Z. Each axis has two limit switches, so you need to do it twice. First, you need to enable them. like I do and then you don't need to enable the X home Y home just leave it there Z Z home the same then move to the port make it one for X axis then one for Y axis one for Z axis move on to pin number make it 11 for X axis then X home as well, then make it 12 for Y axis, then Y home the same, then 13 for Z axis. Next, you need to enable active low. You don't need to um, enable the X home or Y home or Z home, just leave it there. Then apply it, then save it. The sixth step is for output signal settings. And you find it enable one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, there is no seven. And then you enable one to five, okay, one to five. Don't enable, enable six. And then output, output, you need to enable one, only one. You don't enable two, three, four. Then to port, make it one for enable one, and then zero for the digit trick one 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 two one 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 and then zero for six then one for output one okay the next step is uh, pin number pin number zero for the digit trick then 14 for enable one, 14 for two, 
fourteen four three fourteen four four then five also fourteen yeah so I'm making all fourteen then fourteen four enable six output output is different output is sixteen okay then the last step is uh, active low enable one two three enable one enable two enable three and then output one yes don't enable the four and five see you have to do exactly what i do here okay then click apply and then save that's it The seventh step is for step motor setting. It is still in the config and then motor tuning. All you need to do is to set three axis X, Y, Z. And if you want to use A axis, then you need to do the setting for A axis as well. So let's start with X axis. Uh, one thing you need to know is the setting for X, Y, Z are the same, exactly the same. Only the exit, only the A axis is different. So let's get started. Make it three hundred twenty for steps per twenty-eight thousand for velocity. Then three hundred for acceleration. Mm you don't need to do anything about it just leave it there and then make it 5 for step post and 5 for dirt post then click save axis setting okay move on to y axis make it 320 then 28,000 300 Step post 5, third post 5, the same as X axis, and click save axis settings. Then the third one, 320, the same, and then to 8000, 305 for step post, 5 for third post, okay, save. Then move on to the A axis if you want to use the four axis. Okay. This one is different. And 26.66. And then 700. Acceleration. 100. Step post. 1. Okay. It's not 5 here. 1. Then save. S six seconds. Then click OK. Yeah, that's it for all the Mac three setting. If you still have any questions about the software or about the machine, feel free to contact us. Peace out.